In this video, we will learn about alternate exterior angles. Anytime you have two lines, and those two lines are intersected by a transversal, two pairs of alternate exterior angles are created. Alternate exterior angles will be on opposite sides of the transversal, so you can think of the alternate word meaning sort of opposite, and also on the outside or exterior of the two lines. In this picture, this green angle would be an alternate exterior angle with this green angle. Similarly, this red angle would be an alternate exterior angle with this red angle. Notice in each case, the angles are on opposite sides of the transversal and on the outside of the parallel lines. Similar to alternate interior angles, alternate exterior angles will be congruent if the lines are parallel. And the other way around is also true. If the alternate exterior angles are congruent, then we can know that the lines are parallel. So we can write that like this. Alternate exterior angles are congruent if and only if lines are parallel. This is a biconditional statement which has two conditional statements in it. It says, if alternate exterior angles are congruent, then lines are parallel, and also the other way around. If lines are parallel, then alternate exterior angles are congruent. So for the first one, if alternate exterior angles are congruent, then lines are parallel, that's a situation where if we have two alternate exterior angles marked as being the same, so if this is 100 degrees and this angle is 100 degrees, then even though it wasn't marked, I know that these lines have to be parallel. The other way around is if we know that two lines start out as being parallel, and they're marked as being parallel, that means any alternate exterior angles have to be congruent. So if this angle over here is 60 degrees, I know that this angle over here also has to be 60 degrees because it is an alternate exterior angle. Alternate exterior angles exist even if the lines are not parallel. So in this situation over here, where it was not marked that the lines were parallel, those are still alternate exterior angles, but we don't know whether or not they are congruent since the lines are not parallel. We tend to focus on the situations where the alternate exterior angles are congruent or where the lines are parallel because that's when we have this interesting property about those things having to happen at the same time, lines being parallel and alternate exterior angles being congruent.